<laughs> Even now, the moon is huge, and you can see all the craters and whatnot. Kind of like that moon back there. Yep. And I wasn't even listening to Team Skull. Oh yeah, they want apples, didn't they? They ransacked the food storage. And that's a, the greatest thing, because... How are we supposed to munch and crunch every night, like we always do? Yes, but it turns out they took one thing in particular. And Perfect apples. Perfect apples. Items that you will never actually get in-game. You don't get them. Well, I could get them Animal Crossing, but not here. Yes, well, this is an Animal Crossing. No. We don't have Tanukis running mobs wanting to break our kneecaps. True. Oh, sorry, our leg benders. <laughs> leg benders? Is that Why not? Is that a form of, um, is that a form of element bending I never heard of? Yeah, sure, we'll go with that. Alright, so now this opens the path to Apple Woods, doesn't it? Yep. And, uh, that's a mainly- And- What? And we learned who did it. We, we knew who did it, like, five seconds ago. Yeah, true, but this is just the, con the confirmation. It's like, we're going to eat apples the next day. We ate all the apples. Yeah, I get it. They're bad. We get it. You can stop now. They're not as good as Team Meanies. Nah. I mean, better name, stupid, like, stupid Pokemon. Yep. And they don't have a Gengar. The Gengar was the best part. Yeah. I I hope the I hope if there's an enemy team in a Super Mystery Dungeon, they're better they're better than Skull at least. Yep. So yeah, I deleted the two missions I didn't do. So let's just pretend I did them and move on to Apple Woods, shall we? <laughs> oh yeah, no, we we totally completed those missions. I, I say as of course. I say as I'm throwing them in the trash. Yes. And finally, a new dungeon. And you might actually survive this because this is a mainly a grass bug dungeon. I think so. Yes. However, it's a yes and no sort of thing because a little technical problem happened with me while I was recording this. My computer crashed. Oh. And I had to restart Apple Woods. So this was all for my first recording session. The dungeon itself is when I retook it. Well, now that you've ruined that, you've ruined the magic. Yes. Well, at least it's running smoothly. Well, both times it was a flawless run of Apple Woods. Well, of course, because you're a fire type. Yeah. <laughs> I usually have the I, should... I usually have the settings so much faster than when you're walking. Yeah. But you're saying. Um. Uh, I should say, if you need, if you need food, you come to this dungeon in the main story because you'll find lots of gummies, lots of big apples, which will restore your hunger fully. And yeah, that's about it. Well, well, that's easy to remember because it's apple words. Yes, there's also another dungeon which you unlock by a side mission, which I'll be doing right before I complete the main story, called Oran Forest, which was that blue bit of forest right next to here. In the manor. So what's better, Apple Forest or Orange Forest? Uh, Orange Forest is better than Pokemon to grind on. Oh. Oh yeah, that's a. Burn. Is that a type of dungeon that like opens from a special mission? Yep. Right. Hmm. The music in Apple Woods reminds me of Mario Party 3 for whatever reason. Yeah, I can see that. I've been, I've been playing Mario Party 3 whenever my friends come over. It's either I hate myself or they hate me. Which is just- Have you done- have you done the chaos route of Waluigi Island? Oh my god. Yes I have. I want to do Waluigi Island again. You recruit a Caterpie? Uh, Why? Yes. He's so useless. Be <laughs> because he offered? <laughs> Uh, Caterpie. Brings back memories of I think he dies in this dungeon, but if I recall correctly, I'm not too sure. I'm not surprised. Look at him. He's a Caterpie. Hey, he's more useful well, he's more useful than his evolved form. Well, when he evolves in the Metapod, not catching Metapod itself. Yeah. 
Well, isn't it when you have a partner that's a metapod, they, they just stay in one place or something? I think so. I've never actually done it. I think I've done it, just to see what would happen. Like, pseudowoodos, metapods, and... Well, pseudowoodos and any of the cocoon Pokemon, they just stand in one place. Yep. <clears throat> Not these guys. I hate Exeggutor. Like... Insert the thing from the first Pikachu sketch ever from the movie here. <laughs> Exeggutor Oddish. Yep. I love that. But, That's so cute. <laughs> but it's just... Yeah, expression the bell sprout, but insert bell sprout here. Yeah. But I just hate Pokemon with like um hypnosis are the worst. Ugh, yeah. Now Matt Right when you're fighting with them, not against them. Well, that's it. So yes, XI seeds. Well what does that do again? You see everything? Uh no, you see nothing. It's confusion oh. basically. Oh, if you have a strong idea of the map layout, it shouldn't affect you if you get to play it, but basically you throw them at enemies, they get confused. Right. Because even bosses fall for those seeds and they're done as shit when they fall for them. Sometimes I like eating them just to see how different everything is. And it's weird seeing decoys in this game. Yeah. What are they supposed to be anyway? Like, um, what was it? Like, Tricos? Uh, the substitute dolls? Yeah. Uh, I always thought of them as lava tars. Really? Oh, I that's what I, that's what they look like to me. I guess I could see they that. They kind of look like lava tars. I mean, considering the substitute, did the substitute dog uh, turn green in second generation or third? Uh, second, I think. Yeah. I don't know. I don't see substitute often, so. Substitute was a um. Blue gummy. Must get blue gummy. I think by the time at the end of this, you'll have like 10 blue gummies saved up. Hopefully, seeing as I'm still hoarding them. You hoard them from the very beginning. Yep. Oh, not the combi. Yeah, uh, combis are easy. Yeah. That's because I get to burn everything inside. Now that you're finally out of Waterfall Cave. Oh, hey, Beedrill. Yep. <laughs> and there goes the Beedrill. And there goes the <laughs> Bye, Caterpie. <laughs> You will be missed. And he died for a combi. You idiot. <laughs> he died to a combi as when we were saying combis are easy. Yeah. Well, I do know Gus, but I'm a torturing, so to me they're easy. And to Leroy, they're easy because he has spark now. Right. Hello, other combi. <laughs> and... Goodbye, other combi. <laughs> oh no. Goodbye, other combi. Because <laughs> you missed. Yeah. Oh well. <laughs> Oh look! Burn the tree! More things are that Crap. hit fire! Oh! <laughs> burn! Burn everything I ran out of burn! <laughs> Damn it! Must wait! But, yeah, mm -hmm. I, when I'm in this dungeon, these kinds of dungeons where I've got moves that are super effective, I'll just use the max elixir as soon as I run out of super effective moves. So you can burn everything again? Yep, and then yep. I realize what that is. <laughs> it's like, oh, hey, a stupid tea. Oh, I'm super fine, so you better turn around. Plain seeds do nothing but restore your hunger they give you a tiny, tiny bit. By one point. Really? Yes. Yep. How useful. Hey, they're more useful than used TMs. Yeah, true, but you can recycle them. Yeah, true. You get a heart. So yeah, you get a heart. Kakuna, Metapod, and all those, like with, like with every single Pokemon game, they're basically free experience. Yeah, but like Red Gummy. Yeah, but aren't they so scary when they harden at you? They're about as scary as they were in that anime episode, the Harden match. Oh yeah. Well, they made. Well, they somehow made Harden really. Um, Cool looking in a Pokemon Stadium. from that minigame? Yeah. Oh, yeah. I mean, that was cool. They don't get crushed by rocks because they harden. Well, if you time it right. Yeah. Oh, I always love those games. <laughs> I just realized there's no point in me beating my microphone because it's still gonna be picked up on the 
audacity fail, but yeah, I'm sorry, but I've got a little bit of a hay fever this morning, so. Uh, yeah, that's fun. Uh, spring's coming up for you? Spring's here. Oh, uh, yeah. Actually, while I'm here, because I've got a tap, it's right here. <laughs> it's so full, but tomorrow's gonna be 81 here. I don't understand this. Now you see, the rest of the world uses the Celsius system. <laughs> so to us, 81 would be, how are you not dead yet? <laughs> I don't know what 81 would be in Celsius. <laughs> 81 in Celsius would be something like, to you, 300 Fahrenheit. <laughs> or something ridiculous like that. Sounds like the surface of the You sun. would burn! <laughs> Oh, oh no, no, it's 81 Celsius. I made up <laughs> I made up a fire right now. <laughs> Go, steal the human torch. Yes. Oh yeah, it was Team Skull all along. I could have suspected it from the other two times they said it. Of course it is. Why wouldn't it be? <laughs> the only useful things about these guys are what Wiggly Tuck does later. I, yeah. I dare not spoil it now, but it's amazing. Uh, and what Shadow does near the end of the game with them. Uh, yes. They're just there for... to be tortured, in all honesty. Yep. When reverse psychology fails. <laughs> now you see, I'm willing to consider them to be a little bit smarter than this, because... It's either that, yes, they were going to pull a dirty stunt like this anyway, or when they, when Leroy says he says that he's not going to fall for it, they just turn on the on its head, so it was a no-win situation, basically. I, I'm willing to make, I make them sound smarter than they probably are, but still. But that's the thing. They're stupid. Yeah. Oh, is this going to be another boss battle? Oh. No. <laughs> I hate it when you're gearing up for a battle and <laughs> Zubat! <laughs> Why are you here? <laughs> Why did your teammates grab the food, but not you? Because who cares about Zubat? <laughs> Damn it. They used repel. <laughs> Come back! By the time I catch up to the repel, would have worn off. But yeah, I, I hate it when you're gearing up for a battle. It's like, oh, this is gonna be tough, but then there's no battle. Yeah. So wait, did they take the apples for themselves, or did they give it back to the guild? You'll see. All right. Save. Well, we've had our first in-story failure. <laughs> and no, those other times don't count. You failed. <laughs> That's you. <laughs> Bless you. Thank you. Uh, feel bad. <laughs> you leave me no choice. For the time being, you'll go about dinner tonight. Well, screw you too, you stupid bird. There's another time you go without dinner. Like, when you yeah. when you fail the, um, century <laughs> minigame. Which I do come close to this session, I think. I'm not... Okay. The worst thing about this, though? Which we'll see in a minute. That's an order! <laughs> Not only do we go without dinner, we watch everyone eat dinner. That's terrible. Behind the skunk. <laughs> Dude, like, be reasonable here. Hiya! <laughs> How's it going, buddy? Why would you even tell him? You know what's going to happen. Oh. Wait, what? can tell no lies. Don't feel blue, don't feel blue. <laughs> As I explained there, uh, we kinda sorta don't have any. <laughs> then what's he supposed to eat? The tears and sorrows of chat up. <laughs> Those tears right there? Yeah. Yeah. You must have? <laughs> oh god, calm him down, please. No! Oh, boys, is shaking! Don't make the big- Cover your ears! 
Don't argue, do it now! Don't make the big baby cry! Ow! How can we cover our ears? We have no hands! You have no hands! Nor does Leroy, he has paws! Well, he can still reach his ears. Yeah, true. <laughs> so yes, they brought the guild perfect apples. Just so the place won't explode. Well, yeah. Wigglytuff can learn explosion. He can learn every anything. I think he can learn metronome, so he can learn anything. Oh, true. But it's all random. True. I've got to say, I do love watching metronome fights and just watching the sheer randomness of it. Watch, uh, like, metronome triple battles with Mew. Oh, jeez. <laughs> They're amazing. So, yeah. Now we learn of Team Skull's plan. After exposition that we did just see. <laughs> so, basically, what they're saying is that... They're going to steal the treasure of the expedition right out from under our noses. D don't they? Try to, <laughs> being the key word there. Wait, they know exactly where we're going? Not yet. But how do they know there's treasure? Because it's an expedition. Oh. Of course! <laughs> I guess that's answered my question. <laughs> That actually timed, timed per bet more, more perfectly than I thought it would for this <laughs> conversation. Of course, of, of course it did. <laughs>